Celia Umenza has lost count of the times she was forced to move houses. What she does remember is that she has survived three assassination bids. What does Umenza do and who are the people targeting her? She is an environmental activist in Colombia. Her mission is to stop farming expansion and mining on indigenous land. I believe that our legacy, and more than mine, ours, is always, always to say that the struggle and resistance must continue. And only in this way can we survive as people. Only in this way can we conserve the cultural identity that we have now. Only in this way can we say that the environment is something so important for human beings that it is the life of human beings. She has made several enemies during her battle to save the environment. The activist is on the hit list of guerrillas who make profit by illegal mining. A walk near her home, a drive in the city, anything can prove deadly for Umenza. And at that moment, a handmade explosive device used by the guerrillas fell. It hit us. It hit a wall like that and it sent me that way and I thought that was the end of me. After that the gunfire started and all I did was crawl with, I was with my two nieces and I got into like a water tank. She has survived murder attempts but at a personal cost. Deterred by the constant threats, her partner left her. Umenza's children have also been living in hiding. The activist has received little help from the government, who accused her of being involved in anti-state activities. There, the guerrillas made me a military target. And the military and the paramilitaries told me that I was a guerrilla because I was from the mountains. According to an NGO, Colombia is one of the world's most dangerous countries for environmental activists. But for people like Umenza, the fight must go on. View report, We On, World is One. We On, now available in your country. Download the app now, get all the news on the move.